Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to more Honkai Star Rail, where today we are diving into March 7th's companion mission. Oh, yes. And uh, Teo and I are going to go back and forth between reading because uh, we're still recovering. So let's do this. <laughs> Dosh, you there? Uh, no. You're one of those people, Daniel. What's You're up? <laughs> Fine, I'll be nice. I suddenly remembered there was one thing that caught my attention during this trip to the La Fu. The Matrix of Prescience, Ultima, at the Divination Commission. The Master yes. Diviner used th that thing to interrogate Kafka and saw right into her memories without Kafka even saying a word. So I was thinking, could this Matrix be used on me? It is worth asking her. Why not? Yes, yes, I, I want... Or, actually, yes, yes! I wanted to ask at the seat of divine foresight, but after thinking about it, I felt a little uneasy. I'm gonna wait for this to scroll. The Law Fu had just experienced a huge incident. Jing Yuan is injured, and the Master Diviner needs to manage the whole place. Hmm. I couldn't bring up this personal <coughs> matter, so I thought I'd wait till she wasn't so busy, and then we could go to the Divination Commission together and ask her. No problem. I knew it! You're the best! All right, Total Recall. That's a reference. What? No. I, I love that movie. That's a great movie. Actually, both versions of that movie are good. Mm-hmm. All right. One, zero, one, zero, one, Hello, Foo. Good morning. Is work going well today, Master Diviner? I am extremely busy of late. If you have something to ask of me, do not delay. All right. Uh, Just ask. We're already taking up our time. You were about to say something along the lines of, how did you know I wanted to ask something? But then you remembered who you were talking to and decided not to bother, correct? You really live up to your title, huh? Of course. I run a dozen hexagrams before I even get around to breakfast. The results are never far wrong. Dang! All right. Today's divinations threw up some unexpected complications. The hexagrammatic position was facilitating between the water and heaven trigrams. Yeah, I know. The Matrix of I don't know. gave the following interpretation. You will have three uninvited guests. <laughs> this is ultimately auspicious. Well, we're two. Where's the third one? Ultimately auspicious? Wow, sounds pretty good to me. Seems like we really were destined to meet today then. Hmm. You know, I see you've been using the Matrix of Prescience to divine into Kafka's past. Well, I have a similar request. This would be a really awkward quest to do after we find out March's backstory. Hmm. I see. You wish to use the Matrix to relive the past and awaken parts of your memory? Mm -hmm. Viable in principle, but whether the Matrix is truly capable of achieving this result remains to be seen. No idea. Have you ever used it on someone that, you know, has amnesia? <sighs> I knew it. Things are never simple, are they? I'm assuming it's going to work very similarly to, like, how Kafka didn't know the plan. Because I, 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 how, how does that work? Because March has no clue about her past. But with Kafka... Kafka's situation was different. Oh? I feel I must explain in detail the principles behind the Divination Commission's ultimate weapon to avoid any misunderstanding. You really don't have to, but if you want to... The Matrix of Prescience does not allow one to remember anything. It merely collects data in order to infer past events, in the same way that future events are inferred. Hmm, okay. Just as Realm Keeping Commission officers collect ballistic evidence to recreate the scene of a crime, there are materials from which we can infer the past. These may be items related to the experience or memories of the people involved. Hmm, I see. Miss March's predicament is very different from Kafka's situation because she doesn't remember what happened in her past. Ah, mm hmm. Can you use her eyes? I am no medical professional. But fortunately, I'm very fond of reading. We understand that there are two types of memory loss. 
One where the memories remain dormant, floating around in the unconsciousness unable to be awakened. And another that involves direct erasure of memories from the brain. Yep. That sounds scary when you say it like that. Someone erased Macha's memories. What? Who would do such a horrible, mean thing? Do you think that maybe March erased her own memories, potentially? Possibly. Why don't we try using the Matrix of Prescience to determine which situation pertains to Miss March? Let's begin mm. then by preparing the requisite inference materials. Miss March, your memory is unreliable. To guarantee the Matrix's accuracy, you'll have to provide something related to your past experience. Anything will do. Ice. Ice will do it. When you're ready, come and find me in the Matrix core. Uh, the Diviner said I need to provide something from my past experiences. Hmm, what should it be? How about a Sienjo souvenir? <laughs> ah, I mean, you know, I guess that could work, but probably not. Probably not. Why am I walking? But who are, who are we to say no? Maybe that's it. Who knows, I guess. Maybe. Yo. So, have you acquired something from your past? As a nameless, surely you must have souvenirs from your journeys that could evoke memories. I've got lots. It's just, I don't know what to choose. Oh, it's probably, okay. It's either her eyes or it's like her pictures. Don't know. The ticket stub from the express. Ah, proof that I boarded the express. Oh, it's a ball. Sorry. The conductor gave me this. What was what was that music that played in the background? Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. Memories from the Astral Express? That should do the trick. Your work permit for the space station. Every time I hear that freaking whatever that is in the background, I think of Among Us. No, listen to it the next time. I refuse. March is unapologetic. I got you. March's unapologetic <laughs> smile is displayed on the permit. The note below reads, March 7th, level one researcher. You vaguely recall that researcher level started with two. The only career path this permit opens is the one that leads to the bathroom. Something mm. related to your work. Good. Nice. Actually, this won't do. She never really worked there. The Geomero Orb. <sighs> Shiny and pretty. I picked up this little guy in Bella Bog's underworld. Are you sure it's not radioactive? Uh, how could something so beautiful be unsafe? Ah, you, many things. Many things are. I can understand the young girl's fondness for glittering gemstones. Well, moving on. A cup of immortal's delight. Man, you heard that it. You heard delicious. it. Delicious. Man, that does look good. What the heck? Why do you One still have of my that? My fondest memories on the Sienjo. <laughs> no comment. I happen to prefer Star Taro bubble tea. They both look good to me. That should be enough. Is that it, Miss March? Are you not able to provide possessions from before you lost your memory? No. What? Uh, before I lost my memory. So, something I don't remember getting? Even then, I couldn't be sure it was from before I lost my memory, right? It may be strange to you, but to infer the past, I need materials that were pertinent at that time. Could you try recalling some memories again? From before the memory loss, before the express, I'm sorry, Master Diviner. When Himeko found me in the ice, I was stark naked, like a newborn baby. I didn't have any items with me. Well, the ice will do. And before you ask, no, I don't have any of that ice lying around. Oh. Can't you make more of it? It melted away not long after I was rescued. Are you sure about that? What about your six-phase ice? You sure are a smart cookie. My six-phase ice ability must date from before the memory loss. Master Diviner, any ice I create should do, right? It should indeed. I'll have someone place the material in the base of the terminal, the Matrix. Hmm. Miss March, 
please position yourself in the Matrix core. We may begin our inference whenever you are ready. Cool. Just getting right to it. What do you think's gonna happen? Uh, I guess we'll be sucked into a flashback. <laughs> or something will go horribly wrong. Oh boy. Oh boy. The Matrix has clear diagnostics. Miss March, are you ready yet? Uh, I'm pretty sure I should be almost kinda ready to go. <laughs> this would be terrifying. Just Please a bit. be prepared. Not all memories are suitable for reawakening. People carry with them much pain and suffering. Hmm, good. If you're not ready, we can pause the inference process. I would never wish for good intentions to result in harm. Uh, I'm okay. Let's do it. Only way to find out is to give it a go. Oh, yep. Very well. I will soon connect you to the Matrix of Prescience Ultima, where the Matrix will read your memories and guide you back into your past. If you reach a block in your worrying. memory, the Matrix will use the data gathered to derive a scenario and construct a possible past for you. Something that makes it even more mm. worrying, in my head at least, is the fact that March may not have had her memories wiped. It may just be the trauma. She may have just forgot everything because it was so bad. Well, time to put her through it again. Uh, got it. Oh, uh, can he join me too? What? I'm sorry. That would be highly inadvisable. You form the nexus of the Matrix's inference. He would only introduce redundant data to the system. In other words, inside the memory palace that the Matrix constructs, the only person you'll be able to count on is yourself. You got this. Don't worry. I can communicate with you from outside the Matrix and manipulate the recollection process to a certain extent. Oh, fun. Let's begin. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Here, long life gave birth to eternal memories, within which contains endless agony. Here, survival instinct considered a communal memory. Com oh, condensed. Condensed communal memories. Within which contains endless sorrows. Here, the accumulation of wisdom bred memories of plenty, within which contains endless searches. Here, the... <laughs> of nurtured <laughs> memories within which contains <laughs> when where memories shatter, nothing exists. Oh, is that her real name right there? Potentially. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, boy. We're going to be stuck as March, and I cannot customize a team. Just double check. Uh, hit challenge. It may give you. Yeah, okay. Team must include Fush uh, Fushuan. Nice. That works for us. Oh. Well, actually, you, worse you, than, uh... Yeah, ours. no, just use ours. Oh, we'll put Clara <coughs> over there. Oh, well, you... <laughs> Fine. Clara. <coughs> then ours. Then... Uh, Lynx. Yes, sir. And then... Zila. Zila, sure. Zila sorry. <coughs> As more of a temporary character. Yeah. Start. Weird we don't need March, but okay. <laughs> well, technically, it's Fushuan's quest. All right. Oh! The Matrix of Prescience has reconstructed your past. Okay, now. Before you is a space generated from the memories and items you provided as raw materials. Oh, it's her again. Cool. <laughs> Are you okay, Miss March? All good. <laughs> Only a little dizzy. I'm good. Everything seems normal. You have a strong constitution. Most individuals feel nauseous after being presented with a dizzying excess of information provided by the Matrix. Hmm. Oh, I must be seeing things. Why are there two Fushens here? Uh huh. Your eyes are working just fine. One of the Fushuens is a projection of me which allows us to communicate with each other at all times. The other Fushuen indicates that I existed during this part of your experience. Mmm, makes sense. What experience is this? It looks like the healer's market. Oh, sad. A 
unless I'm mistaken, this must be the time we broke into the Alchemy Commission. Yeah, why are we here? Really? Uh, that can't be right. I remember there were lots of Cloud Knights in the plaza. Well, this is just a Matrix inference, remember? Distortions are possible. Although, the scale of this distortion is surprising. Try communicating with the Fu Xuan you see over there. We should hear what the Master Diviner has to say. Oh. Oh, oh, what? In <laughs> uh, Fu Xuan with arms crossed or Fu Xuan with hands on hips? Probably the top one first, right? Miss Fu Xuan, is that you? Uh, wrong, Fu Xuan. Talk to the other one. Okay, good. No, 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 that was the correct one. Miss Fu Xuan. Uh, wrong, Fu Xuan. Okay. Just wanted to talk. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Ah. I haven't finished instructing you. Running around in the memory space without understanding its basic functions can cause permanent damage. What oh. now? Yeah, okay, understandable. Hands on hips. Miss Fu Xuan, is that you? If we want to resolve the Stellaron crisis, we must refine the question. What is the crux of the problem? Generally, it is believed that when one seizes on the crux of a problem, the problem will split open like bamboo on the edge of a knife. The what? Nobody could have foreseen the catalyzing effect of the Stellaron in the Ambrosial Arbor. As the ancients said, blessings bring about misfortune and vice versa. <sighs> Nature has its own algorithm, and it is precisely when fate wins betwixt blessing and misfortune that I, a master diviner of masterful proportions, am called on to save the people of the Lafu. I this felt like an AI conversation. <laughs> I forgot how arrogant she used to act around us. What the heck is she talking about? Master Diviner, did you actually say that at the time? I can't remember. It would appear that in Miss March's estimation, I'm somewhat of a blabbermouth. So it's not really the past. It's just based on her perception of the past and the machine guessing on the rest of it. That's kind of cool. <laughs> no, uh, I've always seen you as a, a masterful master diviner. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Despite the obvious distortions in this experience, the base materials from which it is composed are taken from your actual memory. There is no falsehood here. In other words, your subconscious mind thinks that I... Talking tongue twisters. Mm. <laughs> uh, it's mainly just that I uh, can't always comprehend the lofty ideals and um, principles you discuss. Uh huh. Forget it. Now is not the time for losing one's temper. If the inferred experience is distorted, we should focus on filtering out each distortion one by one. Otherwise, we won't be able to trace your memories back any further. Mm, good. Um, this is getting a little complicated. Is there a simpler explanation? We're fixing the wrinkles. <sighs> Draw your bow and fire an arrow at that Fu Xuan. Whoa, oh. we're gonna beat her up. Huh? Makes sense. Does it now? Yep. Yeah. Oh, whoa. See, that's better. What a headache. Okay. Handle this however you want. A quick divination and awaken. Bless him inside it. Deeper. Not all night or forget you. Look out. Stay back, Clara. Are you all right? Stay back, Clara. All these freaking guys are just booping there. Chill the flip out, guys. All right. I got a hang of it now. I'll end your misery. I see. Annihilate. All right, next time I use ults. Uh, that freaked me out. I don't like people suddenly deciding to fight me. <laughs> now, let's see who's here. Ting Yoon, Welt. General Jing Yuan, and also him. Just him. Well, I don't have to fight all of them, right? 
The Master Diviner was easy peasy, but I don't think I could take General Jing Yuan. Ooh, easy peasy? <sighs> the interference factor creating the distortion here should only have one source. That is, the person present who shouldn't be. So I have to pick someone and clear them of interference? Wait, what? I guess. Exactly. My projection will disappear for the moment so as to not cloud your judgment. If you can hear my voice, then it means I'm watching over you. What? You're the best, Master Diviner. Okay. <clears throat> I hope the best version of me can overwrite the gloriously absurd version that lives in your subconsciousness. Mm. The person present who shouldn't be. Who could that be? I mean, Welt was here, we were here, so let's start with us. Mr. Yang, hi there. March, get ready. The next fight is going to be very dangerous. Uh-oh. Huh? Which next fight? <laughs> this one. Bam! Stay focused. Fantilia is headed for the Ambrosial Arbor. If we don't stop the Lord Ravager, it'll be a catastrophe. Okay, all right. Got it. Another thing. The future is what's most important for us. Don't you agree, March? What? Dwelling on memories can numb your sense of the present and inhibit future ambitions. Miss Fushen, do people in memories always say weird stuff like this? The distortions we are experiencing are unorthodox. Wait. Us. Hey, fancy seeing you here. <laughs> hey, it's fine if you don't want to talk in real life, but this is my memory, so it's my rules. Come on, say something. Oh no. What a horrible, inexplicable thing are we gonna say? Something. Ah! Sorry. I've never heard you scream that loud, I don't think, Daniel. <laughs> Seriously? We have similar recollections of him. Leave your memories in the past. They have no place in the present. Oh. Uh, did you hear that, Master Diviner? Now he's talking weird. Oh, are we the uh, distortion? I think we're. I think everyone hears the distortion. Roll up, roll up! Miss March, would you like to take a look at the latest edition of the Sienjo Beauty Index? The chance of drawing a La Fu Playboy card is super. For high right now. What? Wow, this is a weird version of her. Miss Ting Yoon, it's great to see you so happy, but I can't help feeling a little sad. The past is in the past. What is there to feel sad about? Live every day as if it were your last. Don't be sad. Wait. You know, the distortion must be the general. He wasn't here at this moment. Feels like everything's distorted, though. Yeah. General, hello. General. Uh, General Jing Yuan. Uh, Jing Yuan. Oh, what's his deal? Who falls asleep standing up anyway? This is clearly your subconscious projecting onto the general. Ah. Uh, Remember now? The general wasn't there when we broke into the Alchemy Commission. Looks like we found the source of our distortion. Oh. Okay. I guess we'll just do it then. Yeah. Or are we going to miss out on dialogue for not doing all the others? Do you want to try doing dodge and see what happens? Or would, like, nothing happen? Don't know. Or maybe we'd get unique dialogue for getting it right the first time. Good call. Yeah, that's probably also a thing. General, ah, hello. Let us know in the comments. General? Uh, general. Uh, <clears throat> oh, what? This is. Oh, I remember. Mom. Seven. Ah! Oh, you scared me. Why'd you wake up so suddenly? Are you not satisfied with your life as it is? Oh. I. I'm satisfied. Then why are you obsessing over the past? Yeesh. It's uh, not great. You don't mess with me. Do I have to even pop any alts for this? 
You could do uh, Fu Schwens and uh, break everybody. Oh, true. It's not like it's hard to bring it back. True. <laughs> yeah, there goes that. It came together. Converge and awaken. Commencing research. Deeper. Things. I'll never forget you. I want to Actually, I'll do this too. too. Do it. Nice. Boing. Boing. The damage. She's not even close to being full built. Full built? Fully built. And the alt's back already. Yep. I don't need it. Oh. <laughs> Oh boy, you've done goofed! That was pretty epic, Daniel. Thank you. Hmm? What is that? Is that a heater? That's a heater. Uh, I know what this is. It's a Bellabog heater. Um, wait a minute. What's a Bellabog heater doing at the healer's market? We're going further back in time. It looks like part of one experience has infiltrated another. A foreign object, so to speak. A foreign object? That sounds like a medical issue. Will it require surgery? Of us beating it up, possibly. No. I believe the object is a sign of the Matrix purging distortion. It has managed to trace back to another one of your experiences. Mm. Make contact with the object. Let's see if we can jump over into that experience. But before we do that, can we do all the other ones? Yes, we can. Mr. Yang! March, get ready. Huh? Stay focused. Okay. Another thing. What? Dwelling on- Miss Fush- The distortions we are experiencing are- Okay, clear Okay, distortion. so we can do them all. Oh, never mind. That just gets rid of him. Well! <laughs> no! Well, just actually did the boy. Bellabog. I've seen that name somewhere in the astral charts. Yeah, it's a nice place. There are many similar star systems on the Xianzhou trade routes. Unfortunately, all of them lost contact after the appearance of the Antimatter Legion. Yeah, kind of went under. Yeah, Bellabog is a kind of snowy doomsday city. <laughs> there are heaters like this all over the place. Otherwise, people <sighs> wouldn't survive. Come on, Master Diviner. I'll give you a whirlwind tour of Bellabog. Oh, this is tying into that one trailer. Uh, is touching a heater a good idea? This thing is red hot. What if my hand turns extra crispy? Yeah, it'll be fine. It's okay. This is a memory space. If something hasn't injured you in reality, then it cannot injure you in memory. Mmm, that's horrible. Well, I was never beaten up by Jing Yuan in reality either. <laughs> Enough of that. Touch it. <laughs> uh, hey, don't pull on my hand. I. Ow, ow, ow! Hot, hot, hot! Ah, it does hurt. But it hurts enough to make progress. Uh, what the actual. That thing was flaming hot! You said things that never happened to me in reality couldn't happen here. Couldn't you just, like, not touch the red part? I said that if something hasn't injured you in reality, then it cannot injure you in memory. I didn't say anything about the sensation of injury. Mmm, so it felt like she was burning her hand off. That's nice. So this is Bellabog. I was expecting it to be cold. Oh, it's freezing. What? Master Diviner, aren't you cold? I can't stop shivering. Hmm. Hmm. Most likely a result of me never having experienced true cold. I'm afraid you'll have to do the shivering by yourself. Oof. Fun though. Fu, you and I have shared experiences. And so I was able to provide more active assistance. But in Bellabog, you'll have to rely on your own judgment to ascertain the source mm. of distortion and get the foreign object to appear. Oh, goody. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. Makes sense, actually. Oh, Miss March, I have one more thing to ask. Have you ever experienced great suffering? Probably. <laughs> yeah, probably. Uh, what? 
I don't think so. Why are you suddenly asking me that? Sometimes people forget extreme memories to protect themselves from suffering. Perhaps you didn't notice, but in your memories of the Lofu, everyone you met was either hinting or explicitly stating that you should stop trying to remember. Oh boy. Yeah, it's kind of a bad sign. I believe this is most likely your subconscious communicating with you directly. Yeah. Though, of course, we cannot rule out that external forces may have interfered with your memory. In the latter case, it is possible that someone decided to leave warnings in your subconscious to prevent you from recalling the truth. So, I'm mm. gonna... I'm just going I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say March is probably some sort of royalty of or some she's gonna be someone equally as important as royalty or something. Probably. Am I really that important to someone? I don't think there's anyone who'd go to all the trouble of locking up my memories. Here's the here's the thing, March. You are frozen in a magical ball of ice that can never be basically destroyed. You're probably really important. Probably. And yet, memories are precisely what you seek, no? Hmm. I say this to say one thing. Are you certain you wish to continue exploring your memories? You said external forces might be messing with my head, right? That just makes me more curious. No one gets away with locking up my memories. Let's go. I'll show you the way to Goethe Hotel. Oh, bad things only happen there. <laughs> Very well. I must admit that I'm finding the whole matter more interesting by the minute. Hmm. This memory should be from the first day we arrived in Bellabog. By the second day, we were wanted criminals already. The person present who shouldn't be. Who could it be? Uh, well, we're going to talk to everyone anyway, so... I why are you here? <laughs> and you two shouldn't be here either. <laughs> no one should be here. Technically, he was here to arrest us. Oh, you're right. And you were technically here for a scam. I don't think you two were ever here. So, start with your part. Miss March 7th, welcome to the Sampo Hotel. I'm Japard, the security here. Why would hotel security need to be armed to the teeth? Is there great lawlessness in Bellabog? No, nah, it's all wrong. Uh, no, no, no. Japard is a captain of the Silvermane Guards. Just like how the Lafu has its own Cloud Knights captains. I have no idea what he's doing running security at a hotel like this, though. March! It's your head! It isn't so surprising. In attempting to pursue the rational, we piece together the unrelated. The result is a seemingly meaningful fantasy. A fantasy called life. What? Excuse me, Miss March. Do you need anything? If there's nothing else, please let me get back to my duty. Also, allow me to remind you. You cannot change the past. The future is all that's left for you. Ooh, all right. Hmm, that actually does feel like something he would say. That's hmm. kind of wise words. Huh? Oh, oh, Bella's here. I didn't even see her because she's so small. <laughs> The tea service at Goethe Hotel is first class, especially this whale tide spring. They say that an architect once used the preservation's power to make camellias bloom on the snow plains, and that this tea is made from those leaves. Okay. Uh -huh. Whale tide spring. Isn't that a variety of Sienjo tea? My brain must be filling in the blanks. Probably because I never drank any famous tea in Bellabog. Mm. So bitter. Yuck. Mm. Bitter tea is good for your health. Not always. Ugh. Bitter is bitter. If it tastes like that, it doesn't really matter how good for you it is. There's an old saying in Bellabog. Blessed is he who can eat the bitterest of bitter. What? These experiences are becoming increasingly distorted. Yeah, they are! Seems like my subconscious mind has no talent for screenwriting. Hmm. I'm not sure your conscious mind does either. Ouch. Uh, I'm not denying it. Ouch. Double ouch. Hey, Pela. 
Now is the age of the Sampo Hotel. What? Welcome to the Sampo Hotel, Miss March. The Sampo Hotel used to be called the Goethe Hotel. After old Goethe retired, Sampo managed to trick his way into acquiring this place and renamed it after himself. I could see him doing that. Yeah. Luckily, the high quality service of the hotel remains undiminished. It's still the best place to stay in the administrative district. That's nice. I don't know why, but I, uh, the fact that they said Sampo reminded me. Uh, shockingly, Sam's not going to be in the next patch. A lot of people thought Sam was coming soon, so hopefully we'll see that guy soon. No, instead, we have Mr. Fabulous and uh, the Spooky Girl. Oh, dude. The 1.5 characters look so good. They look so... They look nutty. Oh. And one of them has two voice actors. Don't well, know what that means. Don't know what that means, but I'm very excited to find out. I should mention, the Sampa Hotel's new slogan is, Don't think about the past. Strive for your future. Sounds like the kind of ad copy that Miss March would like. Honestly, okay, this here's- This girl seems sorry. quite trustworthy. Yeah, yeah Pale's actually pretty awesome. The thing about all these warnings is, I partially agree with them, but I also partially disagree with them. March should be allowed to remember her past, but she shouldn't obviously focus on it and lose sight of the present and future. Because that's what matters. Uh, that's just the mm -hmm. work of my subconscious mind. Man, I wonder who the main distortion is. <laughs> Miss March, long time no see. <laughs> Welcome to the Sampo Hotel. Uh, the Sampo Hotel? This is Goethe Hotel. Was Goethe <laughs> Hotel. <laughs> now it's the Sampo Hotel. In the autumn of his years, old Goethe got too old to run this place, so he handed it down to his most trusted young confidant, Sampo Kuski. Yeah, no, this is pretty accurate. And before you get the wrong idea, there was zero trickery involved. This was a cherished <laughs> agreement between gentlemen. You see, old Goethe and I chose to face the future instead of clinging to memories of the past. You should do the same, March. This blue-haired fellow has an air of deceit about him every time <laughs> yeah. he opens his mouth. That's ridiculous. <laughs> you don't need a jade abacus to get a feel for Sampo. Let's uh, clear that distortion. Oh, okay. Wait, it wasn't him? No, apparently not. I feel like the hotel being named after him was a big enough hint. Apparently, that was not hey, the case. Hey, I am so sorry. What the flap? Welcome to the sample. The sample. Luckily, the, I should met this girl. I think Palo was here too, so let's clear that. Yeah, okay. So it's gotta be Bronya and Zila. I guess it's gonna be a duo fight. What an F, much like the, hmm, the force that's distorting this experience is nearby. Oh, oh. wait, what? Did we, just, <laughs> did we just skip a bunch of dialogue? Oh, Do you rip. have to make it sound all scary? Rest easy. I can guarantee your safety while you're inside the Matrix of Prescience. Yeah, uh, hold on. Yeah, wait, wait a sec. What an excellent cup of tea. It's a pity no, it's not the same everyone thing. can appreciate its beauty. Much like the gift of forgetting, Miss March, it's bitter at first, oh. but with a gentle aftertaste. Hmm, this Branya is really different from the Branya I remember. The force that's destroying this. Do you have rest easy? Okay, but what about Zila? Long time no see, Zila. March? Long time no see. How's everything been going since you left Bellabog? The Express never looked back. It headed straight for the other end of the galaxy. Um. Because that was its fate. The same goes for us. We can't return to the actually past. next. Actually, next patch, we're, we're actually coming back to Bellabog. So March, don't dwell on the past. It won't do you any good. Trust me. Uh, got it. Thanks. These warnings are ongoing. The situation is becoming stranger by the minute. It sure is. Uh, let's press on and see what awaits. Oh boy. Yeah, let's get rid of her. What an excellent, much like the hmm, the force that you have. To rest easy. Really oh no, it's Zila. Oh wow. Long time no march. The express march. Uh, these war heads sure. 
I remember our second day in Bellabog was mostly us being hunted down by Silvermane guards. We didn't meet Zila until way later. Oh, that's right, because Bronya was here. She we was didn't meet Pela, though. We were Which out front. Means oh. Zila shouldn't be appearing in this memory. She's the source of the interference. Pela was with uh, Bronya. Yeah, in which I guess. case, we must eliminate her. Seems like you don't trust me. It's not that I don't trust you. It's just... An answer is not required. She's merely a mirage hindering your progress. I understand. Let's do this. So destroy it. So destroy her. What a headache. <sighs> Actually, you guys. Oh, yes. They're very annoying. And uh, they have a lot of health. What the heck? Yeah, they sure do. Okay. Wow, really? All right. Annoying. Yeah. No, they always do that. It's horrible. You probably are going to want to clear alts. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, go ahead and do it. I'm not afraid of I want to protect everyone, too. Help me, Mr. Sparrow. He's here to eliminate. He's <laughs> Let's just pop all those bubbles. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. Beautiful. I'm okay. It is gonna block it, but hey, it breaks. It'll bre beat up the guy in the middle, right? I think something what the fuck? Do you mind? The guy in the middle is like, what the flip? He's like, bros, you just killed me. You're probably gonna want to alt actually these guys. Oh, beautiful. Won't need to. Easy. Enemy annihilated. What's this? Let me see. Developed on a Herta space station. Mm hmm. Seems like this must be the foreign object. The next experience should be meeting him for the first time. Herta space station. Oh. And this should be the last air. Well, second to last, I guess. Can we talk to her? No. no. Beep boop bop bop beep boop. Shame we didn't get to see the stunning vistas of the snow plains. This hotel lobby must have left a deep impression on you. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Well, waking up after a great sleep in a comfy bed to find out you're a wanted criminal tends to leave a deep impression. Yeah, that would do. What the flip is my hair doing? It's being hair. I guess. Whatever. Let's move on to the next stop. Uh, I mean, the last stop. Let's go. So long as you're ready. Oh boy. Touch the foreign object. Uh, I'll take a monitor over a red hot heater any day. Hmm. True. Beep it a bop. The toilet here. March, wake up. We have to hurry. Huh? Are we going? What about Miss Fushuen? Wait, hold up. What? Fushuen? Who's that? And there's no time for daydreaming. The space station is in crisis. Uh huh? W what do you mean? Come with me. Asta said that the Stellaron is stored in that room up ahead. And I'm guessing the Legion might also be interested in its whereabouts. Oh, this is before. Okay. I know this memory. This is before we met him. Who? March, you're being really weird today. <laughs> Follow me. Okay. Poor Don has to turn around every time we make him stop. <laughs> Don Hung, where are you? Whoa. Uh -oh. Master Diviner, can you hear me? Oh, darn it, something must have gone wrong. Okay. What am I gonna do? Why did Miss Fushuan pick the scariest time to vanish? March, can you... me? No, just me. You're breaking I'm up. I'm getting more and more evidence that your memories have suffered interference. But I don't know where from. <sighs> Looks like I'll have to do it by myself this time. Oh, let's not break the game. Uh, well, let's start from one side of the room to the other, I guess. Oh, it's good. 
you insist on looking back, you'll find nothing but confusion and chaos. You were the last princess, oh. and also the last survivor of the Diamond World at Livin. The planet was burned to an obsidian hellscape the moment Nanook ascended. Oh, flip! Ah, that's not great. I freaking called it! Filled with despair, your parents swaddled you in warm clothing and placed you into an ice ship. As they watched Wait. you sink into the turbulent waves of the starscape, they felt a newfound hope. Wait, wait, but she was this just Superman? Kind of, yeah. You are bound and raised by strangers. Wait, hold up, wait. You are the only savior. The promise of rebirth. This is sounding a lot like Superman. This is Superman. Oh, wait, I wrote that. That's a story I made up about my past. What? Mihoyo? Oh, what was that about the... What the, what the, what the, what the, I I thought I I thought Mihoyo's like oh we know what people think. Wow. Got him. I mm. owned. Ah uh, great. Forget memories. Now everyone gets to see my imagination. <laughs> oh, let's uh move a little further in. Uh, Dale, what? who do you think you it's gonna be? You've forgotten your past experiences. Surely your bow there is enough evidence for you. You were once a galaxy ranger, engaged mm. in a bitter fighting battle with the remnants of the swarm. You rescued a planet in the Emerald System that was about to be swallowed by a black hole, smashing through Dr. Primitive's carefully laid plans. What? Dr. Primitive? You were severely wounded during the battle for Von Walk. The leader of the rangers encased you in ice to protect you and waited for you to recover. Nah, it's not right My either. Bo? But Himeko made that for me. You're lying. Well, technically, Herta is. Who lost their authority as a goddess? Wait, what? Huh? Wait, I didn't read it. What? She just said she lost her authority as a authority as a goddess. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. March seventh. One of the nameless aboard the Astral Express. After being picked up by Himiko, she was freed from the six-phased ice in which she was encased. She lost all memory of the past. Because she had no past to speak of, she was an eon, and eons have no past. From the moment they ascend, the past and future of their existence becomes inundated by their path. That would be trippy, actually. That's, uh, weird. March 7th's mistake was the loss of the authority of the eons. Could it be? That never even occurred to me. But I guess it's not impossible. Oh, just go over to him. <laughs> actually really wish it was Stella. Oh, dude. That would have been <laughs> very funny. March, leave your memories in the past. Oh. Why do you insist on returning to them? If they were so important to you, wouldn't you have remembered them? The moment a nameless boards the express, a new life begins. We set out on a new road, never to return. Explore, trailblaze, but do not dwell in the past. You'll tarnish the reputation of the nameless. Mm, kind of rude. rather talkative, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah, distortion. Uh, enough! You're not him. Nothing like him. He would never try and force me to give up something so important to me. Yep. I don't care who you are. Disappear right now and let me pass. And don't you ever pretend to be one of my friends again. That's cool. Oh. Probably just a normal fight. Oh boy. Targets not her. Mm. This is gonna hurt a lot. Okay. Okay. You need to die. <coughs> you may right want to alt the oh flip. Do you alt the guy targeting? Yeah. Okay. I'd say so. Okay. The Gatling gun guy is about to hit you real hard. Then. Oh, there you go. Okay. Wait. Extra turn. Let's go. I'm so glad that killed. Your the omniscient as one. I'm actually gonna pop this heal on her. On the bright side, doesn't give her increased aggro. Thank you, game devs. 
Thanks for at least being that nice. Star Rail game devs are pretty nice. Hmm. I hope I helped. Oh. 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 You guys are responsible. Oh, did she come from the garden? Weren't there coordinates sent out from the space station? <sighs> Weak heartbeat and pulse. March, you better do CPR. This is the first time we met him, but he isn't here. Who are you? I don't remember you. Uh oh. I am a messenger of the Garden of Recollection, Miss March. Please refrain from looking back upon your past. What? Interesting that you lot are responsible. Leave the matrix of prescience and return to reality. The past is not worth exploring. It will only hurt you. Uh, oh, well, that kind of prevents us from You're leaving. You're the one who needs to leave. I'm not letting this go. The Garden of Recollection? Did the glow sweater send you? Are you the one meddling with my observations? What do you want with this girl? No matter the nature of your intentions, stealing others' memories like this, deceiving them, blinding them. I cannot allow that to happen. Let's go. <sighs> you leave me no choice but to resort to unconventional means. Miss March, this might feel uncomfortable. But I'm going to enter your memory world and help you clear out any obstacles. Mmm, good. Oh, nice. Ah, uh, flip. please not her. You okay? Go ahead, go ahead and pop uh, Claire's alt. There's a chance every so often to counteract that. I don't know how it works, but which one targeted? I think that one. Could be wrong Disappear though. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Nice. Okay. While I'm here. Yeah, go for it. <sighs> Great. See if you can get this kill, right? Yeah, probably, but I'm gonna pop this first. Boring. You can also use uh, Fu Xuan's alt to break some guys. Could, but I'll just do this for now. Let me end your misery. Ow. E. Die. Well, not amazing, but oh well. Should be enough to kill him at least. It's not. Never mind. Ah, that's acceptable. Preparing for collection. Time for something I need to be brave. Should be enough to kill the guy on the left. Or not. Okay. Oh, free free fodder. Let me end your misery. Go ahead and get rid of him, yeah. Get owned! Oh! Rude. Very. Allow me to make it to the commencing research. I'll never forget you. Eliminating threat. Don't that good. Oh my goodness, you have a lot of help. Oh jeez. I'm okay. To protect everyone too. Just nice. Do this. Yeah, do that before he gets his next move off. He'll probably target Clara, hopefully. Oh, he's trampling. No, oh, still targeted her. Okay. Nice. Uh, I think this is still get another round, right? Yeah, no, it's not fading. Information in accordance. Okay, next round it fades. Goodness. Probably just pop uh, Zeal's alt, honestly. Yeah. Now you'll get some bonus damage next round anyway, so that's nice. Bam, 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 bam. I love that. Ow. Ow, come on. 
You done goofed! Target specimen sighted. <laughs> He's gonna die. He won't survive. Commencing annihilation. He did. Very nice. Or she's dead, Thanks I guess. Thanks for your help, Miss Fushwen. Oh, we're on the express now. <laughs> I promised I'd watch over you. Besides, I've been blessed by the Wisdom Walker. I will never tolerate efforts to impede the truth. Got you. But that person said she was a messenger. The Garden of Recollection. Why would they come after me? Okay, so did the Garden take her memories? I guess. Many members of the Garden have their own agenda. It's impossible to confirm anything from a cursory introduction. Wait, the Garden is its own faction? I thought it was just... No, memory... No, they just have a bunch of their own objectives. You know, I wonder if um, March has anything to do with... um. Was it Fooly who disappeared? Don't know. This is the Astral Express, no? It would seem that you're nearing the source. The Matrix of Prescience Ultima should start making further calculations soon. Do you remember where it was exactly that you were discovered? They set the ice down in one of the passenger cars. It ended up being my room. Then let's pass through this carriage and find your room. Huh. Can we finally enter, uh... Let's oh. crack open this ice block. Oh. Perhaps we can still save the girl inside. Okay. Scared the fuck out of me. Be careful not to harm her. The parents. I've got this. Pom pom, go and get the first aid kit. Aw. Going, going, gone. Oh. This must be when the crew first found me. I don't remember a thing. What's going on? How come we're back at the start? It's the messenger. She's interfering with your movements again. Oh, goody. Don't look back. Keep going forward. Huh? Who's that? Don't look back. Keep going forward. Six Don't look up. back. Keep going forward. Okay. It seemed like that kid was trapped in ice, but the substance doesn't share the same physical properties. How bizarre. Mm. The crystals show at least six structures under differing conditions. Six phased ice. The galaxy really is an enigma. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Very interesting. Okay. Back again. A. Hey. Of course, I hope we can take her in. Or uh, rather, I can offer a conclusion based on the most basic of moral judgments. Uh. Now that we've found her, we have to look after her. Fair enough. But naturally, I'm concerned about whether or not this places the Astral Express in any danger. Yeah? The Astral Express welcomes everyone. Don't worry. Do what you feel is right, and Pom Pom will take care of the rest. Aww. Thanks, Pom Pom. Thanks. I feel more at ease now. I just hope she'll have a good time on the Express and not feel too alienated from the rest of us. Stop worrying so much. Pom Pom will say it again. The Astral Express welcomes everyone. Freaking love Welt and Pom Pom. Love that, them both. That was so wholesome. Wow. Dang, dude. One more repeat. So Don? Probably. Yeah. Everyone agreed to take you in. I'm in exile. And by the look of things, you might not have a home to go back to either. But here on the express, <laughs> nobody is alone. Aww. Yumiko said that your vitals were all stable. She just didn't know when you'd regain consciousness. That's sweet. Dang, dude. And here we go. The interferer has been thwarting your progress this whole time. Maybe the only way for you to find your past is to take a step back. Oh. Okay. 
Wait, but the voice right? said keep moving forward. What? Well, that's what they want us to do. Got it. The Interferer has been thwarting your progress this whole time. Maybe the only way for you to find your past is to take a step back. I can only assume this will just repeat. Yeah, it seems so far. Okay. okay. Boop. Don't look back. Keep going forward. I get it. If I do the exact opposite, I'll find my way out. You're a true genius, March. As soon as you open this door, the Matrix of Prescience will start calculating your path. Oh, crap. Here we go. Whenever you're ready. Something's gonna happen. Uh, is this my room? Uh, I didn't get a chance to tidy up. Don't judge. <laughs> this is your room? That block of ice in the center. Has it always been oh. there? No, it is not. Ice? Interesting. That looks like the Forgotten Hall stuff. This mm -hmm. must be the foreign object. Looks like our exploration has reached its final stage. Mm. I will confirm one last time. Are you sure you wish to keep exploring <gasps> your past? Yes. I'm sure. How is this a side quest. I don't know. Oh boy. Master Diviner? She is busy running the Matrix of Prescience Oh Ultima. gosh darn it. You again? What I do with my past is none of your business. Why do you have to make things so difficult? <sighs> Please, trust the Garden of Recollection. Everything I'm doing is for your protection. You I'm don't noticing. protect people by imprisoning them. We know. Ah! Oh. So wholesome. That's one of my favorite <laughs> idols in the entire game. By the way, this if place is better optimized. If you set on learning about your past, then come with me. I'll show you the origin that you seek. I hope that you will refrain from exploring any further than this. Trust me when I say, nothing good can come of it. Yeah, why do I doubt that? That looks really cool how Clara's walking with her bare feet on the uh, imaginary water space. On space? Thing? Yeah, I don't know. The ripples. There it is. Your origin. Your life yep. unfolds from this point on. Full of unique experiences and adventure. Well, we know she was an ice dog. We can you, know that. Can you hide the HUD, by the way? Just possibly for a thumbnail? I'm not sure if YouTube would want that as a thumbnail. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> uh, this video may be demonetized, but oh well. What happened prior is meaningless to you. The value of your life does not lie in what happened in the past, but in the present and the future. The eagle returns from an unsuccessful hunt. The sailor avoids the course they know to be dangerous. And you, my child, should come to learn that the past is just an illusion. What? what? But your experiences now will be remembered forever. It is time to say goodbye. Here, a parting gift for you. I look forward to our next encounter. What? Oh, wait! Hold on! Oh, come on! Don't kick uh, us out there. Oh! Shwen, why did the simulation just cut off like that? Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Just a little lightheaded is all. And the Matrix of Prescient stopped at precisely the same moment. March, I lost sight of you once you touched that block of ice. What happened? It's kind of hard to explain. March and Fu try their best to recount everything just as it happened. You tell them about the mess. You also tell them about the messenger. Oh! So, that mysterious girl was really a messenger of the Glow Swather? Yay! We get to tell them about the messenger in our train. Okay. Interesting. Swather? You mean Fuli the Remembrance? Are they the eon connected to my past? 
Apparently. No, huh. it's too early to draw such a conclusion. All I can say is that it was very likely an eon that sealed away your memories. But not necessarily fully. I don't know. I mean, that makes sense to me. When the hmm. messenger spoke of protection, perhaps she meant the following. By sealing away your memories, the glow swather wasn't attempting to harm you, but to shield you from the memories themselves. Hmm. Still, sounds like we're still none the wiser. Yeah. It's not so bad. At least I know it has to do with the Garden of Recollection, right? It is a, a step. It seems like retrieving memories is beyond the operational spectrum of the Matrix of Prescience Ultima. Uh, that's all right. You've helped me so much already, Master Diviner. I owe you a big one. Mm. If mm. you'll excuse me, I must organize an inspection of the Matrix. Uh, fingers crossed there's no damage done. Mm. Uh, we'll leave you to it then. Uh, uh, run. If we broke something, there'll be a huge bill to pay. Yeah, probably. We need so to run. Uh, do the equivalent of dining and dashing. <laughs> Recalling and dashing. Nice! Let's nice. go. Yeah, so it basically was her companion quest, ironically. I must organize an inspection of the Matrix. Uh, fingers crossed there's no damage done. Nice. Dang. Oh, and it gave us an achievement. Let's go. Total recall. The river let let up. Taste is better. <laughs> just like that past. It can be bittersweet or just bitter. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, can you claim that? Bosh. And that's it. that's it. We're done. Journal has been completed. Well, dang. That was pretty good. We were just teased, and we expected that. Yeah, they're saving it for an actual story beat. Do you think um, the ending to 1.0 uh, will be March's Quest stuff? Potentially. Like I going, guess whenever we deal with the Garden of Recollection. Because I'm assuming that like that'll probably be maybe the conclusion before we go into 2.0, unless they wanted to launch 2.0 with that. That, I have no idea. That could be it. I, yeah. Flip. What a shame though. It was just a little tease. Yeah. Okay, so I guess with that, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us for this adventure. That quest was really awesome. Mm -hmm. And uh, now, now we've oh, flip. We're basically ready for the next patch, but I, I really want to do uh, Lynx's and uh, Luca's quest as well. We should also do Kafka's, actually. Yes, and also the simulated universe is oh, Yeah, part of the swarm craziness going on Before right now. Before we miss in any... Uh, actually, it's probably too late, isn't it? <coughs> heart of the swarm is totally a permanent thing. Yeah, I know, but is there any limited time rewards? Nope. No. Oh, right. I don't think so, not to my knowledge. There are polls. <laughs> uh, I'm assuming that's just... Yeah, actually... No one said anything about limited rewards. I think that may just be rewards. So there are polls behind it. I can, I'll double check and make sure that's not limited. Look how cute their phones are. <laughs> oh. All have such adorable phones. Yeah, those are pretty legit. And Foo's just looks nice. That one looks freaking awesome. But I adore all of their phones. Okay, I guess with that, we love you guys, and we'll, Lord See you willing, in the next one. Sorry. I'm, I'm, I got you. I, I'm so, I talked over you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Aw, that's cute. Whoa! Ooh, that looks delicious. But you didn't even eat it. Uh, she was just salting it, I guess. Yeah, she got, she got stored for later. Bye-bye.